Use a Phillips screwdriver to unscrew the screws on the panel. Take out the cable glands. Insert the cable glands into the reserved hole. Tighten the inner nut of the glands. Loosen the gland head nut under the controller. Insert the power cable into the one side of the gland interface. Pass the pH electrode wire through the other side of the gland interface. The power cable has two ends. The brown lip wire is connected to the terminal hole marked L. The blue neutral wire is connected to the terminal hole marked N. The pH electrode has two wire ends. The red wire end is connected to the terminal hole marked ACT. The black wire end is connected to the terminal hole marked REF. The pH electrode with temperature unit has four wires. Two temperature wires are connected to the temp terminal hole. Cover the panel and tighten the screws. Turn on the power switch. The pH controller screen lights up. Now it can work normally.